There are three ways to upgrade an Android phone OS. Number one, let me start from the most difficult. You can upgrade it yourself if you know how to unlock bootloader, flash custom recovery, and then flashing custom ROMs. Number two, you can just wait for the OEM to bring the over-the-year update and you update it. Then the third way is the most um, you know, simple one. If your phone is old, you can actually buy the latest Android phone that will come with the latest OS upgrade. But in this video, I'm going to show you how to upgrade this phone from Android 12 to Android 13 by myself using Android Custom Recovery. If you're ready, come with me, let's go. Okay, welcome back again to Smart Depot. I'm so excited to have you here today. You see, flashing an Android custom ROM is a dangerous thing. So, disclaimer, I will not be held responsible if you try to do this and you break your phone or you start a thermonuclear war or you just burn down your SD card or whatever. So, make sure you know what you're doing. If you don't know, I will recommend xda-developers.com for you to go learn about Android you know, development. So I'm going to take a Poco F3 running custom Android uh, 12, which is Project Akana, and I'm going to go into Android 13 on Superior OS. So let's jump right into it. So we're going to start with making all kinds of backups. I already have used up up to 210 gig uh, of this <laughs> phone. So I'm going to copy some files and folders out. There are some that are in the cloud. Then I'm going to make my great GP backup of all my user data. Now this app can back up the app APK and then the app data and the permissions. I've already done video on how to do this. So make sure you check the description or watch till the end at the end of this video. So this will back up my 151 user apps and including a lot of heavy games. So <laughs> that's very important. Unfortunately, Android doesn't have any way to back up all user data yet, except you are rooted. That's why we're still rooting in 2023. So as I'm backing up, I'm copying. Now I'm going to make the backup of my backup. <laughs> I found out that using the USB-C 3.0 OTG to copy out the backup of my grid is faster. So I did that. Now let's go into the sweet part. We're going to re reboot into recovery. I've already flashed it up the RP custom recovery. So let's go to install and go to superior OS. For Poco F3, you don't have to wipe first. You have to install and then later you format. I'm going to also tell it to automatically flash TWRP so I don't lose my custom recovery. If you are new, this red uh, lines could mean error message. It can also mean warning. So in this case, it's warning. So I'm not going to really fret about that. After flashing, uh, it's going to flash the TWRP custom recovery, but then I have to flash a firmware, a newer firmware, because it's Android 13. I don't need to reflash the recovery firmware like drivers, and I've already made video about that. Now I'm going to go to wipe and format data. Type in yes, and then it will format data, and then we'll be ready to load the new Android 13 OS. Now is the moment of truth. Let's see what it will boot. Well, it has passed the boot loop stage, so... That means the new Android OS is loading. Yeah, <laughs> this is superior OS. And that means that <laughs> our Android is ready to, you know, show up. I'm going to skip all this uh, Android setup part for you so that we jump into the full OS when it's loaded. And there it is. Superior OS Android 13 is here. So we have to go to confirm to go to settings and then scroll down to uh, system and about phone, go to a build number Android 13 and we're going to bring it up. Beautiful. Okay, guys, that's it for today. We started from Android 12. Right now we are on Android 13 and you can see the beauty of Android 13 right here. Um, so I've just, this is Superior OS and I just installed like one or two apps, WhatsApp and one other app. So in the next video, I'll show you how I will transfer all my 151 user apps from my Android 12 back to the same phone on Android 13 without losing anything, anything at all. You will want to really, really see that. So if you want to know how to unlock Android bootloader, Check out the video on this side. If you want to know how to flash custom recovery, check out the video on this side. If you want to know how to flash custom ROM, check out the video on this side. And if you want to know how to root Android devices, check out the videos on this side. And until I see you in the next one.